Hey everyone, Don Master here. Got a Cornwell tool haul for you today. Um, got a couple things um, I've been wanting and uh, they'll come in handy. And the prices were right, so let's get into this. So first thing I got is the two-piece easy access kit and inflate a wedge kit by LTI Tools. Um, I ordered this last week. I actually really needed it uh, to get into uh, someone's car. They locked their keys in their car and they're not in a rush to get into it, but I've uh, been needing this for a while and it's just nice to have if you're a mechanic. Um, it's, uh, it's the LT140. So this one comes with pretty much everything you need, I believe, in one uh, convenient package. So for $77 which isn't bad I was looking at them on Amazon you can get them a little bit cheaper but I wanted a good quality kit uh, the stack ones are about I think 80 to 100 I'm not sure if this is stack or not I don't think it is so comes with one rod here comes with a second rod I think this is probably a piece that you attach to um, to this one so yeah this is your main this is your main rod and then you screw this end onto it And then I'm not sure what this is yet. I'll have to look in the instructions. And then uh, it comes with a couple wedges. And then it comes with instructions. tells you exactly what to use so this plastic strip gym so I'm not sure that plastic strip gym looks like it goes uh, slide plastic strip into car through rubber door stripping slide one end of plastic stripping toward forward to form a loop over lock button oh I see lift up to unlock door for straight lock buttons use two-way tape interesting so that's what this is for that's the lock gym. And then of course it comes with the inflate a wedge and um, that guy looks like that. So you can pump this up. And this is good quality. The one on Amazon the ones on Amazon, the cheap $20, $30 kits, uh, the, wet, the inflated wedges don't look that great. I don't know if they'll hold up like this one. but So you stick that in there, you can spread the door a little bit, just enough to get your stick in. And uh, So yeah, that's pretty cool. And then you can unscrew this, or push this down to deflate it. So I'm actually going to be testing this kit after work today. Um, 
to get into a car and the battery's dead and he can't he can't unlock the car so I want to get into it with this and replace his battery so that's a pretty cool kit and again this is the LTI tools two-piece easy access kit and inflate a wedge kit and I paid $77 for it and it comes with this deal so that's that I picked up the seven-way flat spade pin trailer circuit tester And that's a IPA product and that's a uh, 7893 so those lights LEDs light up if the circuits are working so that should come handy and then I seen that they had their own pocket pry bars now um, they look kind of cheap they look similar to the uh, ones you get from like JD Deco or or Amazon or whatever, but it was only four dollars, so uh, why not have one that says Cornwell on it? So that's the Cornwell pocket pry bar. And then I've been really needing these. Uh, because the regular pliers or um, hose clamp pliers like these Mac Tools ones I got they work good but sometimes they just slip if you have to get on at a weird angle um, when you got a hose clamp that's down in a tight hard to reach area um, sometimes these don't work um, you know and also, I use my twin grips a lot. And these are awesome, but sometimes these don't work either. You know, they, they grip good, but if you have to get down in a tight spot and you can only get on it from an angle on the hose clamp, they slip off. And uh, one of my coworkers has this, and uh, he let me use it, and I... I just liked it, the gripping power. Um, these are ratcheting, and so I believe Lyle makes these for Cornwell. He had a longer one too, but it was like a hundred bucks. But this one was about fifty. But it opens up, and it's got all those different bumps in there, so that way your hose clamp doesn't slip, even when you go on them at, at funny angles. And this is ratcheting, so it doesn't let loose and um, it seems like the last section you have to snap it down like that and then it locks and then to loosen it you just push down with your thumb on this lever but those are pretty cool so I'm gonna be using these a lot in the shop and then my Cornwell dealer got me a t-shirt um, just says Cornwell Tools on it and uh, yeah so that's pretty cool it's got the uh, little Iron Man on there whatever you call him the American flag tee and um, let's see what it looks like on the back so that's the back of the shirt. That looks pretty cool. Cornwell, forged in red, white, and blue. It's got the American Eagle, and it's got the American Eagle holding on to the uh, the Cornwell guy, the little iron guy, or whatever you call him. And it's got wrenches in there. And that's pretty cool. And uh, I really like that for 20 bucks. And then the front just has that Cornwell logo. But for 20 bucks, that's pretty cool. Um, yeah, it was 20.95 for that shirt. 
So I'm happy I got the shirt. Finally showed up. So anyway, hope you guys like this video and uh, like, comment, and share, subscribe, ring that bell, and uh, I'm gonna keep pumping the content out and doing doing these for you. So. Uh, I seen you guys really like the snap-on videos, um, which kind of, I wish I still had my old snap-on dealer. I don't see him that much anymore. I hadn't seen him in three months, and then I saw him last week, and uh, that video got a lot of light, got a lot of views. So, anyway, hope you guys like this, and uh, we'll see you on the next one. Have a good day.